In this video, I'm gonna show you how to easily create the zoom in transition in Premiere Pro just like this. Tyler here from Video Editing with Tyler White, and if you wanna learn how to edit video like a pro, start off with subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. So here inside Premiere Pro, I already have my two clips down here on the timeline. The first thing I'm gonna do is go over here to the project table, and I'm gonna right click, go up to new item, and select adjustment layer. Make sure that this matches my sequence settings and then press OK. I'm just gonna click and drag that adjustment layer over top of both of my clips. Then what I'm gonna do is go to this spot in between my two clips, and I'm going to select that adjustment layer. Now I'm gonna go over here to the double arrows, go down to effects, and I'm gonna type in transform. Click and drag transform onto that adjustment layer, then scroll down under effects controls, and then I'm gonna make a couple of adjustments. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uncheck the use composition shutter angle, and I'm gonna change that shutter angle to as high as it can go. So it's gonna go up to 360. This is gonna create motion blur in the transition. Then what I'm gonna do is click on the stopwatch for scale, and that's going to create a keyframe. Then without moving the playhead, I'm just going to change this to 300. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press the arrow key, I'm gonna go back three frames. And I'm gonna change this to 100. And that's gonna create a keyframe as well. Then I'm gonna press the little go to next keyframe arrow, and that's gonna bring me to that very first keyframe that I created. Now what I wanna do is go over one frame and click this add remove keyframe button. That's gonna create an additional keyframe. Now what I wanna do is go over five frames. So and then I'm gonna change the scale down to 100. And now I'm just gonna play it back. And that looks pretty good. Now instead of having to do this every single time I go to edit a video, what I like to do is go up here and right click on transform and then click save preset. This little box is gonna come up here and I'm just gonna name this zoom in transition. Then I'm gonna make sure that I have scale selected and I'm just gonna press okay. And now every time that I wanna use this transition, I'm just gonna add an adjustment layer onto the timeline and then I can click and drag the zoom in transition. So if I remove this transform effect right now, I can then click and drag that preset onto my adjustment layer and it's going to have that already created and it's a lot faster. Now when using the preset, it's not always gonna line up perfectly. So what you wanna do is take your playhead in between your two clips and then click on effects control and zoom in on this a little bit and what you wanna do is make sure that you select all those keyframes and drag them to the correct position so the zoom transition works for your video clip. If you wanna adjust the speed of the transition, you can just click and drag out these two keyframes here and that's gonna change how fast or how slow the transition is gonna be. Continue to perfect your skills by checking out this video. Edit like a pro by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. I'll see you in the next video.